And again, you're listening to the Duncan Duo Real Estate Show here on 970 WFLA. You can call us with your questions. we got room for a couple more calls, 990-9352 in Hillsboro, 461-9352 in Pinellas. Got an email question I wanted to get. Um, we got a, a Randy from South Tampa has a waterfront property that he's wanting to sell for more than market value. In other words, he's, he's had it appraised. He's had real estate agents assess it. Uh, he believes that if he gets the property in front of um, rich Europeans and Canadians, that he might be able to sell for higher than than, than its value. Uh, how can a realtor find a buyer in these areas and help him get the property sold for more than market value shows to a Canadian or European? Well, first and foremost, I mean, you can hire an agent. We have a lot of you know exposure internationally with Remax and some of the video marketing that we do. You know, we sold you know almost 20 homes this past year to people who made offers on them before they actually saw them in person, but uh, more than anything, rich Canadians and Europeans aren't stupid. I mean, they're, they're going to do their due diligence, too. They're going to look at uh, the appraisal. They're going to look at the market value. They're not going to pay more than market value. That There's a reason they became wealthy, uh, and it's not because of overpaying. So you can expose it to those audiences, and you can certainly sometimes get a premium for a property if it really fits someone's unique need. We've sold homes to... You know, uh, you know, we, we had one, you know, we sold to a Japanese guy this year that I thought we sold above market value personally. So it can happen, but don't be so naive that you, that you think you can get 20 or 30 percent above, above market value. Just because someone has money doesn't mean they w are willing to um, blow it and not make a good financial decision. They're going to be just as focused on paying attention to those numbers as, as anyone else would be. 